we are going to see procedure in detail uh, procedure is a standalone code like uh, to perform some task it can be a sub program that is, that is used to perform some task to start with like you have to you can create a procedure using create or replace and then followed by the procedure keyword and then you can give any name that is a procedure name then followed by the parameter that is like of type in uh, which is like a parameter that is sent from outside and out which is the parameter which is going to be sent to outside and then in and out which is a combination of both and then uh, there are type like is and as which is going to be like um, specify like uh, what is when where we are positioning the procedure in that way i will explain in detail in the with an example you need not worry about it and then comes the begin and end where the procedure body is going to be so we will see in detail about how to create a procedure to start with i'm going to create a simple procedure so create or replace as a keywords which is going to say that uh, i'm going to create a new procedure or i'm going to replace the existing procedure procedure is a keyword name again and sample is the name of the procedure that i'm going to create so since it is a standalone uh, procedure as i mentioned there are two types of uh, keyword that you can go with that is is or as so i'm going for as because it is uh, like it is a standalone procedure and i'm not passing any parameter so i'm going to just print hello so i'm big writing begin dbms underscore output dot put underscore line hello so the procedure name is sample and i have mentioned type as because it is a standalone procedure i will explain like uh, you'll know why uh, we are using as and uh, when you have to use is in that way so now the procedure is created we'll run this procedure and check so to run this i'm going to create another pl sql uh, um, in program so begin and i'm going to call the procedure which is sample and i'm going to write end so while running you can see that the sample uh, procedure is in called and hello is printed actually i uh, printed the word hello within this thing within the procedure so it has been called and it, the word hello is printed okay it is quite simple now we'll go and check with that uh, parameter a uh, simple parameters i'm going to uh, put one parameters which is c in number i'm going to pass a parameter from uh, the main procedure call so it is c in number so i'm specifying uh, in as a keyword there c in number as i told you there are t three types of specification i'm just passing the number i'm printing the number that is a procedure is created and uh, i'm going to pass uh, say number okay one thing to be noted that here when i am passing 5 so it, the 5 goes to the character c and uh, as i written uh, dbms output underscore dot line the c is printed there c is equal to 5 and when i am i cannot do like this c is equal to 7 inside this uh, procedure it will return in text i mean variable sql because i cannot give a value for in keyword c in number so wherever i am representing arguments as in i cannot change the value c will be acting as a constant so i cannot change the value one thing i can do is i can give a default value like this which is equal to 34 in that way i can give a default value so when uh, i'm going here back to the function call uh, i'm passing the value 45 while i'm running i will get 45 for sure so if i am giving uh, any number I mean, when i'm calling this function without any number the default value will be passed for example i'm removing this when i'm running this i will get 34 because the 34 is assigned as a default value in the procedure you have to note that so one thing to be noted whenever argument is in passed as in i cannot change the value because it will act as a constant so if i want to change the value i i should use the out uh, type here you can see i have passed the argument as out type which means that i am going to pass a value to the calling procedure see i am changing the value c is equal to 9 now i can do this so uh, it is allowed when the parameter is in out type so i i have to put that uh, uh, mean colon equal to sorry colon equal to now if we run the program will okay it is executed now the c is equal to 9 the 9 will be passed to the calling function so here i am going to 
one thing to be noted again here I cannot uh, pass the value from here for example uh, before if I write sample of 6 it won't be passed because I cannot assign the value to the calling function before while the uh, parameters of type in I can pass the value but now I cannot do so so I can pass only a variable so here I am declaring a variable f as number and I am going to pass f here so now you can see that 9 is printed so f is given as a value 9 so you can see here um, the program is saying so f will be given to c and the c is assigned a value of 9 so while I am calling sample of f the function returns a value of 9 because I printed tbms underscore output there so this sample of f will return 9 so can I change the value let me check uh, here I am going to change the value of f is equal to 8 so if I run this like I can uh, whether I am going to check whether uh, the value of f is being changed or not in that way here I have assigned the value as uh, 9 and one more thing I am going to do is whenever uh, the f value is null first time when I am creating that f as number in the function call I am passing directly so when uh, while passing the f may get the value of 9 so again I am assigning the value of 8 and then I am calling the same function let me check whether the values changes or not so I am running this you can see here so I am while running the procedure is created so the c is c first it will assign the value of 9 to f and now I am running it again so you can see clearly that the value does not change so two times it is printing 9 9 it means that the c is taking always a null value that is the meaning here so the out is nothing but it is going to pass a value to the calling function here sample f is the calling function so the out will always pass a value to the calling function so suppose i want to change those values so i going to introduce another thing which is in and out which is going to be a combination of in and out so here I can change the value so let me try that if c is null in which means that first time whenever uh, the function is called the c will be null so it will take the value of 9 so the second time when the function is called I can change the value let me uh, send, I mean, explain this using this example c first year f is a null so um, whenever I am running the program f will be getting the 9 so now I am going to change the value of f into 8 and when I am calling the same function as I mentioned in and out the in variable assign the value and the out variable will send back the value you can see here the 8 is printed how this 8 is printed is I have assigned the value 8 and I call the function and similarly the argument is of type in and out so first time when the uh, argument is coming like f is coming f will be null so it will assign the value of 9 so next time I have assigned the value 8 so just for changing purpose and then this while this function is called it will uh, check whether uh, the c is null no because fc is will contain the value of 8 so it will print 8 here i hope you understand this concept so uh, i mentioned three types which is in out and in and out in means the argument will get some values the out mean will uh, pass the value to the calling function that one in and out mean combination of both things now I am going to explain the other uh, type of procedure which is like uh, within the BLSQL statement so I mentioned earlier that is the two types of procedure called one is uh, like two types in which the procedure can be mentioned one is using is and another is using as so I am going to explain this for is statement see here the, the procedure is not a standalone procedure it has been created within a PLSQL block so it is an example so PLSQL uh, I mean declare statement is there and within that I am creating a procedure simple instead of as I am writing is just a simple example so here I am going to put begin s is equal to 10 dbms underscore output dot put in f s I am going to print the value of s that's it so within that I am printing the value within the procedure body I am printing the value now I am going to call the procedure as we did before simple of end okay just run the program and they can see the output we have created the procedure simple is begin with 
within that time we enclosed the body of the sample I mean procedure and then I called the procedure just you can leave the space run again okay um, it is printing 10 so the pro function is uh, I mean the procedure is running perfectly I can uh, introduce an arguments to here uh, for example I can say um, say HS number H number H in number that way here in the same type like in out and in and out can be used here okay so now I am assigning the H I mean S is equal to H so I am passing a value 20 to H and the H is stored in S and I am printing the S yes there just uh, leave space and run again so you can see the 20 is output 20 is given as an output similarly you can use uh, out and in and out all those things so like um, in will be like the argument is taken as a reference and the out will be uh, the argument is taken as a value that is the argument will be passed as a value in case of in it will be passed as a reference in case of out the argument will be passed as a uh, value so here uh, example for out so I am going to assign a value for H H is equal to let me say 3 so while I am running the output should be 3 this is an example for out ok let me run so you can see that output is 3 so I, I hope you understand this uh, procedure concept thank you